snail. Check it out, a snail. We got an achievement. Let's go. At least we got Flambo. Get out. Hey, Flambo. You like having Flame Princess in charge, right? Sure. Things just way better here with her running a joint. Right so, a how about writing a note to thank her for being an awesome ruler? It'd really help to cheer her up and boost her confidence. Sure, uh, but I need something from you first. Oh my gosh, Flambo, uh, come on. What do you need? You jerk. I used up all my coal when we went through that cool down last time you were here. Mm -hmm. I want to have some more on hand in case things get cold again sometime. Give me some hot coals and I'll write that note for you. Okay. Okay, we'll see what we can find. Can I climb up the stairs or? <laughs> I see you scream, we all see you scream. They're trying I to scream. steal our inspiring portrait of Flame Princess! Get them! What? I didn't even do nothing. What? I'm getting bullied. Whoa. What did I do? I'm the hero. Like, this is like five in this game. Why are you bullying a fucking yeah. game? Oh, fuck. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this, this combat, man, it's like Spider Man. It makes you really feel like Spider Man. I do. I think this is game one game and you're at a company. Like a yes. uh, my website was, but I'm pretty sure one game in the other. Oh. Sit down. Duh. All games when game is easier. Not you, most of them are like really slack. Oh. Yeah, I boy. Our work here is done. Okay, this is about that's a bug. Treasure we can carry. Nice. Give me this. Jeez, there was no need for all the fighting. I was just gonna borrow it for a while. Check it out. One of PB's missing outfits was nailed to the wall behind the painting. Why? Good eye, Finn. Why? PB will be happy to get that back. I bet. Why was that there? What? I huh? Oh, cinnamon bun probably stole you it because he's again. a simp. I heard you came back. You're not gonna leave this kitchen until you clean up that mess you made before when you blew up my firebone soup. No. I want to disagree, but he's right. It's our mess. We should clean it up. No. We're heroes. Heroes don't do that. Spider-Man never cleans up his mistakes. Why should we? Guess it's okay for us to use this mop. Okay. That's right. Put your back into it. Dang. This stuff mops up surprisingly well. Yeah, but it's burning the mop down to a stick. All right, I'm satisfied. Thanks for your cooperation. Probably. Play Birdo. Dizzy is right. Maybe what? what I, Dizzy is right. Oh no, I changed my mind. I did not read the second message that Dizzy Ow! sent. Never mind. Oh yeah, right. Not cool. Never mind. Oh, the broom. Here, boy. Want the stick? Oh. Go get it. Okay, I see. <laughs> get out of here. Firewolves sure like chasing stuff, and they're not too bright. I didn't even throw it. What? <laughs> He'll be busy for a while trying to find oh, it. Oh, that's funny. Youch! That's one hot lump of coal. Yeah, Finn, you cannot be judging people about their brain cells when you touch hot stuff, bro. Come on. That's what I'm talking about. That much hot coal will keep me warm through anything but a total deep, deep freeze. Here's my thank you note. Hope it helps. Okay, thanks. Get out of here, Flambo. Algebraic! Algebraic! Yeah. Okay, cinnamon bun, what do you want? Hey, cinnamon bun, we need your help. Hey, Finn, sure, I'll help you. You've helped me and Flame Princess a lot. Flame Princess is feeling a little down, and we're trying to get people to write thank you notes to tell her what a great leader she is. Okay. You know, to boost her confidence. That's a great idea. She has been kind of down, and that makes me sad. But I don't know if I can do that. What? I can only write when I have inspiration. Otherwise, my words don't come out too good. Okay. Inspiration, huh? Hmm. Well, we'll see what we can find to get those creative juices flowing. How about a picture of her? Hey, Cinnamon Bun, how's this for inspiration? <clears throat> oh, that actually works. <gasps> Flame Princess! Yes, she inspires me to be better. Hang on. All done. 
Here's my note. Gotta hand it to him. CB's a fast writer when he's inspired. Thanks, Cinnamon Bun. Now we have to talk to some more people in the kingdom. I don't think two thank you notes will be enough to boost Flame Princess's what? confidence. Oh, that reminds me. I have this stack of thank you notes that I've been meaning to give to the princess. You mean people have already been writing her thank you notes? Oh yeah, for months and months. The people like her are way better than her mean old father. I just keep forgetting to give them to her. Would have been nice to know that before. Never mind. Thanks, Cinnamon Bun. You've been a real help. No so problem, Finn. See you later. Bye-bye. Cool. Sweet, sweet. Okay. Let's go. Here. Hey, Flame Princess. Check these out. <gasps> Thank you, Notes. Hundreds of them from people all over the Fire Kingdom. See? You don't have to worry. People think you're an awesome leader. So. Wow. I guess so. So how about it? Want to come and play keyboard in our band? Please? So. Well, I guess if I can do such a good job ruling the Fire Kingdom, playing the keyboard again after all these years should be a snap. No, that's not sure. how it works. I'll do it. Well, awesome. Those are two different. We're different at the treehouse like, in a little while. We'll those see are you two there. different skills. Where are you going now? To the forest. We have a singer to recruit. Oh man, looks like Lumpy Space Princess is living in the woods again. She's not gonna be happy with us. It's gonna be tough to talk LSP into singing for our band, what with us getting her kicked out of the Ice Kingdom and all. Hey LSP, how's it going? How's it going? How do you think it's going? Thanks to you, instead of running my own kingdom with my prince at my side, I'm back living in the Lumpin' Woods. Prince? What prince? None of your business, Jake. Now, why are you guys bugging me? Um, well, we, um, see, we're putting together a band to record my favorite record, and we're hoping maybe you'd help us out and be our singer? Okay. Your singer? You have some serious lumps asking me to help you after all you did to me? No way! Yeah, well, we're sorry about that, but you see, um, it's... Dude, your fans! LSP 3D fans, looks so it's weird. It's your fans, LSP! They are demanding a performance! They are? <laughs> I mean, they are! They totally are! Oh my glob, I have fans? Yeah. Of course I have fans! I probably have, like, a whole lumpen fan club. Absolutely you do. She does? <laughs> um, yeah, you totally do. Okay, I can't let my fans down. Exactly. You get them all together, and I'll make the big announcement of my comeback tour. But I'm not doing this for you. I'm doing it for them. You lump it, got me? Yeah, totally. Dude, she did not go okay, well in 3D. He's you should so gather weird. all of my fans in the tree stump clearing in a little while when everyone is ready. I'll make my big announcement then. Oh my god, this is so exciting! See? She's totally on board. Easy peasy. Yeah, except for the part where LSP doesn't actually have a fan club. Just guess we'll Jake, just have stretch to convince a couple of people to something. pretend to be fans. Become a fan, Jake. I'm sure just we can stretch. handle that. The fans were a lot worse today. This game's almost done, guys, I swear. Lock in. Lock in! Nice! Bucket and some rope. I'm sure nobody was using that well anyway. I got it! That was easy. Come a fan. Hi, Tree Stump. How's it going? You again. You already ripped the flower off my head and turned me into a cannibal by making me eat apple pie. What now? I mean, seriously, bro. There's pretty much no other horrible thing you could do to me at this point. Um, we just want you to pretend to be a fan of Lumpy Space Princess's singing. What? <laughs> and I was wrong. If you heard LSP sing, that's like a horrifying prospect. But... Seriously, you got any more apple pie? Because I'd rather be a cannibal. No, you don't have to listen to her sing. You just have to pretend you're a fan and you want to hear her sing. Yeah, the singing will happen somewhere else, we promise. Hmm, that's okay, I guess. But there's still all the nasty stuff you did to me. Especially the flower. I love that flower and you ripped it right off. We're I mean, kind of those things don't grow on trees, man. Well, I guess they do, but you know what I mean. What about if we made it up to you somehow? Did something nice for you? Then would you help us? I guess so. But it would have to be really nice. Not make me throw up. Deal. We'll figure something out, and we'll okay. do it quick. LSP is going to be here any minute. Seriously? 
You set this up before you even ask me? I gotta tell you, bro, you're not off to a good start on the whole doing something nice thing. I'm gonna boo her so bad if you screw up. Like, seriously bad. You won't believe it. Okay. No, no, no need for that. We'll do something really nice for you, promise. Now you just stay here. We'll be back soon. I'll be rooted to this spot. Ha ha ha, get it? Because I'm a... Do you want, never mind. It, it was... Well, hello, boys. Nice to see you again. Howdy. Hi, Tree Trunks. Sorry to bother you, but we need your help. Oh, it's never by the fin. You boys are always there for me, so I'm always here for you. What can I do for you? Do you think we could borrow your gardening spade for a little while? Why, that would be just fine. I just planted some brand new flower seedlings this morning, but I'm done gardening now. Yeah. Would it be okay if we took one of your flower seedlings? I suppose that would be fine. Um, just make sure you plant it in a pot or something with a good handful of dirt, and it should grow up nice and pretty for you. Okay. So, tree trunks. You know Lumpy Space Princess? Oh, yeah. I don't really much care for her. Truth be told, she really can run off at the mouth something fierce. And always being so mean and nasty to people. I don't remember asking. Yeah, that's her all right. See, we need LSP to be the singer in this band we're putting together to re-record my favorite record. We kind of told her she had a fan club, only she doesn't. So we need people to pretend to be your fans. Well, you boys are always doing stuff for me when I need help. I guess the least I can do is pretend to like Lunky Spice Princess singing for Spice. a little bit. Lunky I mean, Spice. How bad could it be anyway? Okay. Okay. Best not to dwell on that. Cool. Thanks for helping us out, Tree Trunks. We'll see you when we have the rest of the fake fan club together. We'll meet you at the tree stump clearing later. All right, boys. See you later. Bye. Bye. Two. Okay. Good digging. That's some nice dirt you got there, dude. Uh, dirt. I think the dirt has to be in some kind of container for that to work, Finn. Okay. Oops. Actually, I don't know why you weren't carrying the dirt in the bucket the whole time. <laughs> Might not be a real flower pot, but I'm sure the seedling will grow to a big, beautiful flower in there. Cool. There you go, Tree Stump. What do you think? Yeah, what do you think? Oh, yay! <laughs> that looks so goofy. Oh, wait. That's actually pretty nice. Wow, thanks. So, are we good? Will you pretend to be a groupie? groupie. Why not? I got a pretty flower on my head again. It's all good. Great, because here they come. Ben. Ben. Lumpin introduced me. Right. <clears throat> Ladies and, um, elephants and tree stumps, here to announce her comeback tour, I give you Lumpy Space Princess. Yay, Lucky Spice Princess, woo! Yeah, woo! All right. Oh my glob! Thank you! Thank, Thank you. you everybody so much! Do you think she notices she only has two fans? Shh! Well, like he said, spoiler alert, by the way, Ben. I'm announcing my comeback tour! Whoa! I'll be doing a private recording session today, but I'll have my tour dates and my new album release really, really soon. Yay! Whoa. And, what the heck, since you're my most loyal fans, you all get a copy of my album for a discounted price autograph extra. Yay. Whoa. Sorry to cut this short, but I got to run off to my recording session. You guys are great. Bye. Yay. Whoa. Phew. Phew. Wow. I can't believe that actually worked. Well, me and Jacob got to run. We have a record to make. Thanks a lot, ladies. Okay. Bye, everybody. Yeah. Bye, everybody. Uh, <laughs> oh. Of course. <laughs> oh, I do this wedding. Got that? Nice. We got all the PB you stuff. You snagged it, dude. PB's going to be happy to get that back, even if it is covered in nasty cave water. Cool. 
Um, let's go here. Let's give it stuff. Thank you for finding all my missing outfits, Finn. After I have People everything recleaned, I can finally change out of this old dress. Sorry to put you guys through all that trouble. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. And what we gotta do now is make a record. Make a record? Yeah, boy! Is everything ready? All the equipment is set, and everybody's on the way to the treehouse. We're good to go. Then I guess it's recording time. Record. Let's go. Let's go. I'm locked in. Let's go. Oh, we did it. We finished the game. I think this is, I think the game's over. Okay, We're almost then. Up. So done. You ready for this? Totally. We're Let's almost free. Hey, everybody. Everybody. Hey, quiet. Hey. Quiet. Thank you. Good job, you. All right, everybody. We're ready to start. Reel to reel on. Reel to reel on. Turntable to maximum spin. Roger that. Band ready. Keyboards ready. Ready on the skins. Oh, I'm so flippin' ready. What about lemon grab? I got this. Hey, lemon grab. Lemon hope is um hiding in the microphone. Hiding in what? He's gonna jump is out as like soon it? as the music starts. Better be ready. I will strike him down with my sound sword as soon as the first notes of the horrid music are played. <laughs> He's ready. Dang, okay, okay, everybody. This is it. Remember, put all of your emotions into this. Dang, we got to okay. fix Finn's favorite record. This one's going out to Finn and Jake Investigations. Cool. We go in three, two, one, and play. Cool. Oh my. The, the song actually sounds horrible, I'm not gonna lie. And cut! Thanks, guys. That's a wrap. We got what we need. We were loving awesome! Oh, that was totally hot. We were rocking out, man! Pimo was helping. Boom, Yay, Pimo! Boom, Let the game's over. Let me hope it's not here. Mm, unacceptable! Unacceptable! What are you talking about? That was awful! Yeah, that, that was nothing like my record. It was a disaster. Was fire, no way. It was exactly right. Yeah. You guys forget. We're using magical auto -tune. recording equipment. Auto-tune, Just guys. listen. Hey, Bimo, play that record. Auto-tune, auto-tune. Finally, this party. It's crazy what auto-tune does, guys. Hmm, told ya. Yeah. All right. Boy, did we have some adventures. And it took a lot longer than it usually takes. It did. But it took so all, long. I'd say the first cases of Finn and Jake investigations were a success. You said it, man. We should do this again sometime. No. But not right now. There's only one thing I want to do right now. Dance. What's that, buddy? Dance, boy! I'm a boss, baby. They can dance like a man. man. I can shake them like a man. Danny, I can shake them like a man. I'll oh, talk to them, baby. I can punch you. Ah, right, cool. <laughs> oh, what's in that? This is the final part of the game, guys. We should play both the Grables more often instead of just watching them. Okay. Grable Babel Grapes. Playing those Grables was It's glitches, as guys! As it's with glitches! Jake fought the giant mushroom with Billy's girlfriend, Ken. I hope you were playing attention. I was. <laughs> Because it's time to guess the thing. Guys, I'm locked in. I know the playable Grables are a lot longer, Mabel, than our normal stories. So we'll take a few Grables to talk through your answer. Okay. okay. What was the theme for our five playable Grables? So actually, the emotion. Good job. You got that on the first try. Let's go. Easy done. That's right. The theme of the playable Grables was the five most powerful emotions. Fear, envy, That's anger, all. sadness, Easy. and love. Easy. The silly wizard guy was afraid he'd spend his whole life in the candy prison. The blue guy got to stay with Finn and Jake again, but he was envious that Finn and Jake had such a nice place to live. Lemon Grab said that the pranks that Finn and Jake played on him this time made him angry. I see. Worse than when he was ruling the Candy Kingdom and when Finn made his pudding all visible at the lemon dinner. Exactly. The sword that Cinnamon Bun bought was supposed to make him happy, but it caused him nothing but grief after he bought it. 
I see. And Finn had to find a way to fix Jeez. the record of so his so shoes to play for him because he loved it. Good job. That's it for this time. But maybe we'll play Mabel together again soon. Okay. Until then, though, I'll see you crimpy glimmers on trial to flip in the dial. I won't. Ah. Goodbye. Along with no copyright music. No. <laughs> Dang it! This is copyrighted. Okay. It's over. <laughs> I can't take it. I got copy. Dang it! Oh my. This is how it's gonna end. Oh my gosh.